This is Bruce Jansen for IMNG Medical Media at the American College of Cardiology, where Dr. Philip Schauer has presented the results of a randomized study of bariatric surgery versus intensive medical management at one year follow up uh, in a group of poorly controlled obese diabetic patients. Dr. Schauer, what did you find? Well, we found at one year that surgery was superior uh, to medical therapy. Both operations, the gastric bypass surgery and the sleeve gastrectomy were able to uh, achieve um, uh, you know, very good glycemic control defined as a hemoglobin A1C of 6% or less. So 42% reached that goal for gastric bypass, 37% for the sleeve gastrectomy, while about 12% uh, met that uh, target with intense medical therapy. And many of the uh surgical patients were able to achieve that 6% or lower A1C off of all diabetes medication. That, that's correct. In, in the gastric bypass patients, for example, all of them achieved that goal without any diabetic medications, including insulin, and nearly half were on insulin prior to the intervention. So there's quite a bit of reduction in dependency on diabetic medications. Now, the name, uh, the acronym for your trial is STAMPEDE. Uh, what are you expecting any sort of uh, stampede on the part of patients or surgeons or hospitals to, to adopt a, a surgical solution? Well, that wasn't the inten intention of the an acronym. It actually stands for Surgical Treatment and Medication Potentially Eradicate Diabetes Efficiently. But I think it, it, the study does mean that uh, many patients who are not well controlled with conventional medical therapy now have you know, an option that can put them in much better control. And the consequence of that is likely going to be a much lower risk of developing these dreaded complications of you know, blindness and, and renal failure, amputation and heart attack and stroke. So this is good news for patients.